Hey everybody, welcome back. It's Odin, and we are continuing our latest run in Xanima, which we're calling the Sledgehammer Run, because obviously I'm trying to just use the Sledgehammer. So, here's the locked door that we just got a key to, so let's go ahead and unlock it. Oh, it opens inward, okay. A push sign would be very helpful, thank you very much, but anyway... Alright, so it's very possible that we could run into, yep, a zombie here. So the fights get a little messy in this room, as you can imagine, because there's, well, lots of obstacles in the way. But that won't stop me from overheading that beach. Ah! Delicious. See, that's the thing about the sledgehammer is, you know, it's kind of slow, and sometimes it, it kind of seems cumbersome, but when you land those hits, man, it is so satisfying. Alright, get on over here so I can see. Darren, thank you. Alright, we got some boots. Does Darren already have boots? I'm pretty sure he does. Ooh. Ooh, shit. Chain shirt and some van braces. I will take those. Oh! Well, no I won't, because that would take my coat off, apparently. So I guess we could give those to Darren. Let's see. What Ooh! Another gambeson. That is awesome. That is just what we needed. All right. So we'll throw that gambeson on Darren right there, and let's see if he can wear the van braces. Should be able to. There we go. No problem. All right. And of course, we've got him equipped with that mace. I'm sure we could find a better weapon at some point. There is a handsaw here and a machete. I wonder. You know what? I think I want to give him the machete. I think I do. I think we need to have some slashing damage. So let's see that equipment again. I've got the crushing damage covered. Or impact, as it were. But I think it'd be nice if Darren could uh, do some slashing while I'm doing some pounding. You know what I mean? Okay. Hey, there's another gambeson, but this one is worn. Don't need that. Alright, there's potentially at least one more zombie we could run into in this vicinity. There we go. Uh oh, two handed axe. So this could get this could get ugly. Whoa. There we are. I want to get Darren involved so he can, whoops, get some XP for his skills. But, it didn't happen that time. Uh, we've already got tunics. You know what? I did not look. Oh, yeah, he does have boots. Okay. And we've got boots and we've got the worn jacket. Nah, we don't need that. And let's see. Up here we just have bathrooms. So, nothing we need there. Alright. Come on, Darren. Alright, so I gotta pace myself to make sure Darren keeps up with me so we always have some good lighting. Okay, let's, let's move forward. Luckily, we've got some decent lighting in this area. Oh, we've got company. Alright, I'm gonna back up a little, see if he'll come through the doorway, even though I know he won't. Or at least not without some serious convincing. Really? Oh man, I hate the new AI sometimes. I really do. Oh shit. We just took some serious damage there. Oh crap, I missed with that overhead. That was embarrassing. There we go. Got him with an overhead there. So this door is making the fight quite interesting. I'm gonna 
move away from it. Let's see if we can get Darren involved. All right, your services will not be necessary today, Darren. You're just going to sit there and hold the torch. I guess that's what we've decided. So I did take some more red health damage there, which sucks. But we will get this health back. But I do believe there should immediately be another zombie here. Where is the zombie? I don't see him. Okay, well. Whatever then. Which way are we going? There we go. Alright, now we're going to break off this way. Oh yeah, so there's that health salve that's always a welcome sight. Oh yeah. Oh man, I love that sound so much. Why did this box make that sound? Oh, because this was here. Okay. Oh god, that's just the most perfect sound. Wow, I don't know how to explain or I don't I don't know how to explain why that sounds so good to me, but it, it just does. That's a fancy jacket, but we don't need it. Oh shit. This is really tight quarters here, but guess what? Darren needs some XP. Oh, there's that wonderful sound again. And of course I got hit. I want Darren to hit him. Oh, bullshit! I think Darren was actually about to hit him and I ruined it. Uh, but it's okay, I'll still call Darren worthless. Because he is. You're just a mobile torch for me, Darren. That's all you are. Alright, we got some more action immediately. That's okay, try to get my camera set a little differently here. Alright, this zombie has a bedpan. Oh, for God's sake, what's going on here? I'm just trying to get out of the way to try and get Darren to get involved. Oh, did we both hit the same? Oh, there you go, Darren. There you go. Oh, shit. Oh, how did I miss with that overhead? There we go. I might be mistaken, but I think all Darren needs to do is take a swing at an enemy to get XP. Is that that might that just doesn't sound right. But for some reason I want to say that someone told me at some point that that was true, but it's probably not true. As usual, I'm probably just just uh spewing ignorant bullshit. But above all, I would definitely want to see Darren connect with his weapon. Because that helps, obviously. Alright, we got more company. As usual, Darren could care less. Or he couldn't care less, I should say. And of course, I have screwed up again. go. Alright, it's all you, Darren. You need to get in there. Oh, of course he's getting his ass kicked. And so am I. Oh, yeah. Run, you bitch. Oh, please. Darren. Darren. No! I didn't... I didn't tell you to run after him. I guess we're gonna keep running after him, aren't we? Oh, I couldn't see. It was too damn dark. All right, Darren, come back, come back. Darren, come back. Is he coming back or not? And now he's just walking around doing whatever the hell he wants. Darren, come on, man. Oh, he is not going to give up on that zombie, is he? No, he's not. <laughs> the zombie comes back, takes one look at Darren, and then runs off again. All right, there we go. Now, who the hell are you? There, now we're good. 
How can they always attack more quickly than I do? I initiate the combat. They don't even know I'm hostile. But mid-swing, they hit me every time. That's way too fast of a reaction. Especially for something that's frickin' undead. There we go. Let's see if we got anything interesting here. Oh, it's some fucking electric blue pants. <laughs> Who the hell would want those? I don't know. Uh, Alright, there's nothing in that room. Uh, let's see. That's just a locked gate. So we need to go in here. To the offices, as it were. There should be some loot in at least one of these rooms. As usual, you can rewind and pause if you'd like to read some of the lore. We've read it a bajillion times. Oh wait, we didn't check this one yet. I need my light, Darren. Uh, some shoes. Well, isn't that just great? Let's see, do we have anything interesting? Ah, yes we do. Hey, a belt! We actually need those, okay. And that looks good. And we should have two zombies in here. Isolate them one at a time. Oh, crap. Darren, you want to get involved, maybe? It's a nice overhead. Hey, ooh, all right. Now there's some teamwork. There's some teamwork. I like to see that. All right, let's open this back up. Oh, he's got a prosthetic leg as a weapon. Let's bring him out here so we can double team. Go get him. Go get him, Darren. Okay, we're done. Oh, there you go. Not bad. Hey, not bad. Get him again. Do all you want. There we go. Just step in there and get the... Ooh. Now, there's a thick leather vest. Now, that's kind of nice. Does that replace the tunic? Oh, no. It replaces the jacket. Yeah, well, we want the thick leather vest for sure. All right, big money, no whammy, stop. Hey, a coiled shit helmet. That will work. Get the hell out of the way, Darren. All right, nothing here, just a washroom. All right. We didn't ever kill the zombie that ran away, did we? No, we didn't. So we can expect some company. Yep. There we go. Alright. Let's see what we've got in here. Whoa, there's a zombie. I don't remember there being a zombie in there. That kind of took me by surprise. This is not a good way to fight them by standing in the doorway. I think I may have landed that overhead, but I can't be sure because I couldn't see. Oh, I know I landed that one. I knew it was a risk coming in here because Darren might not walk in here and I have no light. So we got to back out. If I could just lure him out. There we go. Oh man, I stepped too close. Darren, you are not helping at all, my friend. Oh, it's 
so hard to see, but he's dead. So now that he's dead, Darren will be happy to come in here and illuminate the room for me. Uh, Darren's already got that cap on his head. Doesn't appear to be anything else in here. Come on, Darren. Oh, shit, I didn't even see that. <laughs> well, there's our face plant for this episode. I totally didn't see that. Uh, we've got company with a two-handed axe. Oh, man, I almost, I almost hit the shit out of Darren. Okay, Darren's getting his ass kicked. I need to step in here. Dude, the shadows are crazy right now. There we go. Oh, there's a belt for Darren. That's good. Are these pants special? No, they're not. Alright, let's throw that on. See how he's doing. I'm not well at all. Okay, so I don't... There's no way that I'm aware of to tell, like, what the actual health situation is for Darren. So I don't know, like, if he took a lot of... Uh, yellow damage and he can just regenerate it or if he took a lot of red damage I'm assuming he took a lot of red damage because he was uh, he was cut basically with that axe blade and basically slashing damage is always red or at least almost always red I mean I could give him a health salve I just really don't want to <laughs> if you want to know the truth of it all right, big money, no whammy, stop. Hey. All right. That is... All right, that's good, actually. Let's check over here. Oh, don't get caught. There we are. And nothing over there. And that's just a washroom. Alright, I'm going to talk to him again see if he's recovering health. I'm not well at all. No, he's not going to. Okay, well, because one of our primary objectives is keeping Darren alive, I think I'm going to give him a health salve. I think I am. I've never given him a health salve before. But there we go. Right, so he should be recovering slowly but surely. Unfortunately, there doesn't appear to be anything interesting in here. Damn it. Just want to be sure. Alright, we got that lore, and we got nothing in the desk, sadly. So, luckily we got a nice open space to fight in. Oh, oh shit! He got me with the damn repost, and now most of my health is gone, and I don't have a health salve. Oh, good. Oh, man, I'm, I'm about to die. Hey, Darren, you want to help maybe, you piece of shit? Why did I give you that health salve? Oh, 
Oh my god. Oh, the health situation is horrible, man. But let's see how Darren is. How are you doing? I'm good. Well, I'm glad you're good, Darren, you piece of shit. Because I am not doing good. I gave you my health salve, and that was probably pretty dumb of me. Alright, a little more lore there. And don't need... Well, let's check those pants, make sure they're not something special. Ooh, they are special. Give me those. Thank you. Alright, so... <laughs> Oh man, things are about to get a hell of a lot more difficult around here. This It's not so easy using the sledgehammer and, and trying to keep Darren alive. Oh man. Alright. So this is where we're going to have to pick up next time because we are at the end of today's episode. But I want to thank you guys for hanging out with me. I always appreciate it. Please hit like and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time.